Let's look at manga through the ages. This is ukiyo-e, a form of art which used woodblock printing and was really popular in Japan from the 17th to the 19th centuries. In fact, one of the earliest usages of the word manga comes from the creator of one of the most famous ukiyo-e prints, the wave. Katsuishika Hokusai produced a series of prints that he called Hokusai Manga from 1814 onwards. They were not narrative in the style of comics, but showed scenes from nature and everyday life. The first artist to describe their pictures as manga in the modern sense was Ippio Imaizumi. He has one example of his work from 1895. The term was then popularized by Kitazawa Rakuten, who is now considered by many to be the founding father of modern manga. Fast forward to 1952 and post-war Japan, and we have the release of Astro Boy, an android character who was not only relatable to a country that was rebuilding itself, but for a global audience too. And the rest is history. From the women-led shoujo manga revival in the 1970s to the avant-garde approach of Akira in the 1980s, 